everyone. Happy Saturday, hope everyone's doing well. My name is Adam, this is my channel Mr. B's, UK reseller. We buy things and we flip things for a profit, that's what we do. We buy and sell anything that we can get our hands on, we can make a profit, we will buy it. Um, so yeah, welcome to the channel. Just wanted to put a quick little video out there as I had a little impromptu sort of visit to a couple of charity shops today while I was out doing other bits and pieces. Um, I didn't get to film any footage, but I just wanted to share with you um, and break down what I paid for and how much I'm looking to get back um, on some of the bits that we bought. So quick video and um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. All right, I've got these coats actually loaded clothing today so the first one was this adidas jacket um it was only four quid actually but the sizing is quite good it's a large um which will fit quite a few adults and maybe some some boys uh four pound on that and i look to get 20 to 25 so this one is a country sort of jacket equestrian um, it's by a mate called MLW Country Sport. Never heard of it before, but doing a quick search, I realised um, that it was it was worth picking up for four pound. So yeah, I just wanted to freeze it here quickly. Going back to that country file jacket, um, anything like that, equestrian or wax coats, that sort of thing. If you can get them cheap enough, buy them because there is a big market for that sort of outdoor stuff. Um, yeah, this coat, I love the colours of it, but it's a H&M jacket. I wouldn't normally have picked it up, but it was on the pound rail. And this time of year is perfect for coats. There's an easy sort of 10 to 12 pound in that. Um, this hat was probably my favourite pickup of the day, just because I like hats. But it is a Kangol uh, vintage Trilby. Um, paid a pound, should get 20 to 25 on a good day. It's in nice condition, has got a mark on it but it looks like it could be wiped off, so I'm hoping that I can get that sorted before I sell it. This one is a Christie's. Um, worth picking up, definitely worth looking out for that label. This cost me a pound, and it's, depending on the type of hat, I might be able to get sort of 20 to 25 pounds. This Trilby was just a generic one. Um, it was a quid. I liked it, so I kept it for myself, probably. Um, Marks and Spencer's jackets. If you get wool jackets, women's or men's, pick them up. They go really well. I'm aiming to get about 20 to 25 pound on that one. Once again, this is something I'd never normally pick up, but it was only a quid. Um, so I could get an easy tenner on that, and it will fly off the shelves being winter time. Now this one threw me a little bit because at first obviously I thought Burberry but unfortunately it's not, it's got no markings, it's got nothing in there but it was a pound and I bought it hoping that I could find some Burberry markings but nope. This is a one I never, I never knew about before, this make, it's R-I-E, rear, but they go for quite good money. Um, this is quite a small size, so I'm not hoping for big money on this, but I reckon at least 20 quid, um, and that was about three pounds. I love the colouring. I thought, you know what, it could sell well. So yeah, fingers crossed. It will do all right. Now, by far the best pickup of the day, really, had to be these Dr. Martins. Now, they have got some use, they have got some signs of wear, they do need a clean and a bit of a polish. Um, but I knew that they were sort of slightly longer than the, the normal Doc Martins. And the pattern on the inside is quite interesting. What basically sold it to me was the heels and the soles. The soles have got quite a lot of good use left in them. And they were, she wanted a tenner. I knocked her down to eight pound. You can't really argue with that. So a good clean up and hopefully I should get between 75 and 85 for these. Right, hope you like that one. Um, just, yeah, it was on a whim. We picked up some bits and pieces. We was out doing a bit of 
other shopping and yeah, just pulled out a nice few little bits from some charity shops that I frequent. Um, yeah, didn't have enough time to really film anything, but uh, just thought I would show you my pickups and uh, let you know how much I paid and how much potential profit um, I should get. Obviously, I think the Dr. Martins were the pickup of choice. Um, they were my favorite. Um, they have got wear. They do need a bit of a clean up, maybe a little bit of shoe polish as well. But what sold me on them is the fact that the soles are really in quite good condition. Thought I'd just freeze it there and just ask you guys, if you don't mind showing the love, showing the support, hit the like button, leave a cheeky comment and subscribe to the channel. Have a nice weekend. So yeah, easy money in them and they're a decent size as well. So yeah. Well, I hope everyone's weekend is going well. I hope you're living the dream. Hope you're making some sales and chilling out with family. And um, I look forward to seeing you guys soon. Take care.